let's prove the following equation. The trick identity that the left is equal to the right. So what we're going to do here first is we'll focus on the numerator, then we'll go with the denominator. And for the numerator here, we have get sine of 4 theta. Uh, well, uh, in terms of up here, we're going to use this equation. And then for the denominator, I'll just go ahead and mark it down. We'll use the second term here. All right, so this, for this first term, we're going to end up with 2 sine 4 theta plus 8 theta divided by 2 times the cosine of 4 theta. That should be a 4, not an 8. Um, minus 8 theta divided by 2. So the denominator here, we're going to get 2 sine 4 theta minus 8 theta divided by 2, and then cosine 4 theta plus 8 theta divided by 2. All right, so for the denominator, we're going to get 2 sine, or excuse me, numerator, we're going to get 2 sine 12 theta divided by 2, and then cosine of negative 4 theta divided by 2, and over here, 2 sine negative 4 theta divided by 2, and then cosine 12 theta divided by 2. And let me see here. So what we have is um, All right, so excuse me for that. Uh, what we have here is these two terms cancel, or these twos cancel out, and what we can do here is break this down. So we've got sine. This part on top becomes sine six theta, and we get on the bottom here. This portion becomes cosine six theta, and then this term you can pull the negative sign out of the sine, so we get negative sine two theta divided by cosines and even terms, so you just get rid of the negative there. So then we get uh, this is equal to tangent 6 theta times negative cotangent 2 theta. And what happens with these is uh, the cotangent is just a reciprocal of the tangent, so you can simply rewrite this as tangent 6 theta divided by negative uh, tangent 2 theta. And this is what we were looking for.